Global warming might be making U.S. winter storms colder. Arctic air, especially the strong, swirly winter vortexes, usually stay confined at the North Pole thanks to a boundary of wind called the polar jet stream. That boundary is at its strongest when there's a big temperature difference between the Arctic and the mid-latitude regions, like parts of the U.S. and Europe. When the difference in temperature is less extreme and less reliably distinct, the jet stream weakens and wobbles and allows Arctic air to drift further south. The Arctic is warming four times faster than the rest of the planet. So the temperature difference between here and here is becoming less extreme. And that might suggest a weakening polar jet stream over time. But Arctic winds are complex systems and affected by things like the regional sea surface temperature and difference in pressure in the atmosphere and much, much more. So there's still some scientific debate over how the polar vortex and jet stream will specifically change in the future and over how much of an effect our changing climate will have on it. But we do know that global warming is creating more extreme weather and we're already beginning to feel its effects.